Hi guys, I'm back again, and if I look like a crazy person, that's because I'm a crazy person. It is one o'clock in the morning. I have to get up with the kids at like, oh, Elliot's been waking up at seven because he has to go pee, and then he kind of staggers into my room, so if I'm lucky, I'll get to sleep in until eight. But yeah, I'm just a crazy night owl, so anyways, I wanted to talk about my Valentine's Day haul from Forever 21. I know it's like March now, so you're like, why are you doing this? I I don't know why I'm doing this. I just wanted to show you what I got because it was kind of a fluke that I ended up on the Forever 21 website. I got an email and it said Valentine's Day. It was a few days before Valentine's and it said Valentine's Day sale. I was like, sale? I'm all about that. So I went to online. I never go on Forever 21. And I went on their website and I was like, oh, hells yeah, that is a sale. So I got these. And I should have got more pairs. I only got one because I wasn't sure what the quality was going to be. But these were $7 originally. I'm for $3.50. And they're so cute to look at these little fluffies. They're really fluffy. And this is really soft bendable. So little kids could wear it on their head. And they're not going to be like crying because it hurts too much. Also, how cute if you were going to a bar or something. I, I, I'm just that person. Okay, I love being theme wear. So those were $3.50 should have got more but i got these this is the first time i'm trying these on can we talk about these sunglasses these were how much were these originally oh i don't have a tag for them i don't know i think they were like 14 dollars, and they were on for seven and because we're going down south next month i was like can you really have too many pairs of heart glasses because i do already have one pair but the plan was that i was going to put the kids in the heart sunglasses and get their picture for, I cannot get that tag off. Okay. I was going to get their picture for Valentine's Day for my Instagram. Holly's housewife life. Follow along. And then I didn't do it. So now they're just for me for going down south. But. Oh, these are going to be so cute. Oh my God. These are so cute. I can't believe I didn't try these on until right now. I love that they're like a really crisp, like staggered line cut out. Oh yes. Yeah, so cute. They're really nice too because there's really harsh lighting in here and they have dimmed it. So I'm not going to say they're UV sensitive or protective, but could be worse. I have lipstick all over my teeth. I just put on my lipstick. Actually, it's the Wet Ever Hard Candy Lipstick in the shade Temptress. And yes, it bleeds around your lips a little bit, but this Hard Candy Lipstick was really cheap. Like... I don't know, $4 or something. Don't quote me, I'm totally pulling that out of my head, but it was cheap and it's a beautiful color. Temptress, hard candy, I got it at Walmart. Okay, moving on. Let's do the let's do the jewelry first because we just did the sunglasses. So let's do the jewelry. I got two pairs of earrings and I love them so much. This is one set. I don't know what these were regular, but I only paid $3.99. $3.99 for these adorable earrings. I wore these on Valentine's Day and they were like so cute and set off my outfit perfectly. And they're the kind of earring that I can wear. I might put one in right now. I can wear any time and they kind of just are a statement piece for $4. Under $5. My tea at Tim Hortons honestly cost me $2.17 these days and I can't stand it. I go there and I have to have like a $5 bill to get a tea and that is insanity to me but moving on I guess I shouldn't be a tea addict and drink a large tea but how cute is that so the next pair of earrings same price four dollars and they say girl power and I was just like girl power yes the year of the woman like how do you say no to a girl power what if there is a concert for the Spice Girls like Obviously, I can't afford to go to a real Spice Girls concert, but, um, and they never come to the East Coast of Canada. Nobody would ever come here. However, what is the last big concert we have? I can't remember. However, we get some tribute bands going on on the East Coast, and these are so fitting. So I had to get those, $4. Then we got clothes. This is a dress. This was $14. What was this regular? No tags? Okay, it was $14 on sale, I know that. Oh, it was regular $24, which is just insane. It's a t-shirt dress. Who would pay $24 for this? But my idea was, this is plus size. This is an extra large. 
but my idea was that I was going to, I always write my own, um, I what's the word for it? I create my own t-shirts. I put writing on them all the time. And so I was going to put a love story on this one. I hadn't decided who it was going to be yet. Either Jim and Pam or like Buffy and Angel or I don't know. Somebody was going to be on this t-shirt and I was going to iron it on and I was going to wear it for Valentine's Day, but I never got around to it because just no time in my life. No time. So let's work on that for next year. If I do it now, maybe it'll be ready for next year. And the final item, which is kind of my favorite, I'm not a blogger, big t-shirt, but I did size up in this. This is a, not an extra large, a 1X, and I thought that would be really big. I wanted a super slouchy tee. It's actually not that big. It's really not that big. A 1X to me should be fairly large, especially since it was labeled as a large size tee, and it's not. So it's still nice. I still love it and it's still adorable, but yeah, Forever 21 sizing, so hit or miss. You're like, sometimes an extra large is three sizes too big, sometimes it's three sizes too small. However, I will be wearing this probably every other day, so comfy. This material is the softest t-shirt material ever. So, I look forward to seeing y'all in my I'm not a blogger shirt. Oh, this was $16. Did I say that? I think it was also regular 25 and they do have it in average sizing and plus sizing. So go check it out. If you're interested in Forever 21, there was some good buys lately. They are having another sale this weekend, I think. So anyways, who knows when this video will get up. I'm sure that comment will relate to any weekend. So Check them out a little more often when you get their emails. They do have some good sales there. Regular price stuff is getting real pricey for Forever 21. I'm looking at stuff and I'm like, $86 for a dress, $110 for a dress. This is not Forever 21. No 21 year old can afford $100 for a dress. Like what happened to the $12 stuff? Like where is it? I remember when we went there years ago, I mean this was probably 10 years ago, but it was when they didn't have one on the east coast of Canada and we were out in West Coast Canada, and I bought a hundred tank tops because they were like a dollar each. So you honestly had to buy a hundred of them because if something's a dollar, you're like, yeah, I need, I need that turquoise tank top. I'm positive that'll come in handy. Anyways, I did end up using them as sleep tank tops for a long, long, long time. And painting, I had like paint splatters all over them. I think they've gone to the tank top graveyard right now. I, I'm gonna have to look and see if I can find one. And if I can, I'll put it in my Insta stories. So, I'm going to bed, it's 1 a.m., I'm exhausted. Oh, I also got a coupon for HelloFresh, $50 off coupon code in my Forever 21 bag, which I found really cool. Interesting that HelloFresh, a food service, paired up with Forever 21, but you know what? That's real cool. I thought I might use it for $50. I think that's almost like more than 50% off. I don't know. have to look into it. But I'm going to go put on a Sephora foot mask. I'm going to put on my cozy, I don't know where they are, my cozy pit socks. They're going on my feet. I put my feet mask on, then I put my big thick pit socks over them, and I sleep in this. It's typically a 20 minute foot mask, but if you sleep in it, it really helps dry cracked feet. So have a great night. I hope this goes live very soon. I know I'm so tardy, but we'll talk to you soon. I'm always on Insta stories, so I'll see you over there. Bye bye. Are we done? We're done. We're done. Girl, we done. We're done.